I'll tell you what, man. Personally, I was tired of being Rajon Rondo from the free throw line. Luckily, it's not that difficult to upgrade the free throws. Don't mind the field goal percentage. I'm badge hunting. That field goal percentage comes with it. But a lot of people are asking me how to upgrade G -G -G free throw percentage. I mean, it's the same thing as anything in this game. If you want progress, you just have to come out there and do what you need to do. So in this case, you have to shoot free throws and you have to shoot a lot of them. Whether it's in my career, Pro-Am walk-on, or regular Pro-Am. Anything that puts you on the line, you want to get to the line and make sure you hit those free throws. And this progress will go towards the free throw ace badge. And this is a new badge in NBA 2K18. Once you upgrade it to silver and gold, the rating will increase. So as a shooting guard, my free throw started off as a 65 overall. Once I got that free throw ace on bronze, it went up to 75 rating. And this rating you can only see in game. If you're walking around the playground or the neighborhood, you will not be able to see it. But in game, you can see that I'm a 75 overall free throw shooter and I have free throw ace on bronze. And I can tell you that bronze is already a big deal. You can see if I go to the line with that 75 free throw rating, it's almost an 80% chance, which is way better than what I had without the bad. So, you know, I'll take that. And if I green, you know, it's a 100% chance. So I want to get to silver and see if it makes a difference. I'm gonna get in the gym, do the drill for the free throw ace badge which is basically the free throw golf drill, which you should be used to from NBA 2K17. We had to do this a lot, and now we're going to see if it paid off. In this game, I just got free throw a silver, and I'm going to check my free throw rating real quick. Like I said, you have to wait until you're in game to see your free throw rating, and I'm also going to see if it made a little difference when it comes to the chances of me making the free throw. So let's go ahead and get into it really quick. I'm going to show you right here, free throw ace, on silver been badge grinding i told you man it wasn't that hard to upgrade you just have to shoot a lot of free throws it's tedious now you can see my rating is an 81 it was previously a 75 so it went up a little bit full bar 83 percent chance i'll take it but i will tell you the maximum i've got it with the silver free throw ace badge is 89 percent which is almost automatic so hopefully when i get gold free throw ace badge my free throw rating will be near 90 i'm hoping and praying for near 90. so that's how you upgrade your free throw rating it's a big deal if you play pro-am you don't want to choke at the line it's not necessarily hard to do but it is tedious it does take a while it's something that you really have to focus on just get to the line shoot a lot of free throws do the free throw drill and practice and you'll be good peace